Hello and welcome to today's demonstration of the Silect Grafana dashboards for SCOM. To get started, I'm going to download the dashboards, which I've, uh, which I've already done. And then I'm going to, in my Grafana instance, I'm going to select new. I'm going to import the dashboard that I've downloaded. Now, I've already created two SQL data sources. One data source is for the SCOM uh, database. The other is for the SCOM data warehouse. I'm going to choose those data sources and then import that new dashboard. And as you can see, right away it gets populated with uh, operational data from my SCOM environment. So this opening status screen is showing us some information about the current state of our environment, showing the endpoints that are being monitored, uh, the alerts that are active, as well as the overall health state of the um, endpoints that are being monitored by SCOM. Now, the suite of dashboards that we provide consists of, uh, well, a dozen or so different um, pages. And so we can look into each of these pages. The first, the first couple deal with uh, the state of your SCOM environment itself and uh, alerts, uh, alert severity, here's history. Um, the filter here at the top right of the dashboard will allow me to specify a range of time. The default is seven days, but you can certainly go and look back over a further period of time if you want to see some trends uh, within your environment. Uh, that is certainly an option. Now, further below, the other pages that we provide show more information about uh, the, the state of SCOM itself. So, for example, I can see which, alert, which management packs are generating the most alerts within my environment, again, based on this time range that I've selected. We can take a look at the, the health of SCOM itself. So, I mean, here I'm getting a view of some of the key components of SCOM to make sure they're healthy and in good shape, including the database components and database sizes. Uh, further down, I can see configuration churn. So here is, you know, sort of looking inside the activity within the SCOM environment, showing me changes that are happening in configuration churn that is happening within my SCOM environment. See a chart of daily changes. As, as you can see, it's over that same 30-day time period that we selected. I can see more details about the um, events that are being collected by SCOM and being processed by the SCOM environment. And a lot of really good details showing me uh, what SCOM is doing. Um, if, for example, I'm using uh, SCOM uh, managed instance, and so I'm starting to run up uh, charges based on the amount of storage, the amount of activity within the SCOM environment, um, I can use this information to help me, you know, perhaps tweak some of the settings within SCOM to allow me to uh, maintain my, uh, contain my costs of running SCOM MI. Um, performance collection as well. You'll see this is just taking a minute to run these queries because we are going over a span of 30 days. So it does take a minute to run uh, these queries against the data warehouse, but we'll get it, uh, information about the, the perf counter data that's being collected by SCOM. So those are, that's an overview of the Silect Grafana dashboards for SCOM available at silect.com slash Grafana. You can download those, those dashboards for free. We will be making uh, lots of updates to these dashboards. So um, keep, uh, keep an eye for uh, any updates that we might uh, provide. As always, if you have any questions, comments, observations, feedback you, you would like to share with us, please contact us at info at